incredible force from what was Hurricane Nicholas. The storm made landfall along the Texas East Coast earlier this morning as a Category 1 hurricane. Nicholas hit the Texas coast two weeks after Hurricane Ida slammed Louisiana. The winds were powerful and damaging, but rain may be the biggest concern with the slow-moving storm. CBS 4's Janice Shalaman has the latest. Nicholas slammed ashore as a Category 1 hurricane in Texas overnight, packing powerful winds and dumping significant amounts of rain. More than 12 inches in Galveston, 7 in the Houston area. Across the region, roads are flooded, and at one point, power was out for more than 400,000 customers in southeast Texas. The concern is wind. It's too windy still for them to go out and fix those down power lines. Wind gusts top more than 75 miles an hour in some areas, toppling trees and damaging structures like this gas station. People are being advised to stay home. And that way you'll be safe and then you'll be helping out our first responders as well. Forecasters say Nicholas is moving slowly, meaning higher rain totals and the potential for further flooding. The storm is now headed for Louisiana, where thousands are still struggling to recover from Hurricane Ida. The governor has already declared a state of emergency there as storm weary residents prepare once again. Janet Shemley and CBS News, Kima, Texas.